right? Look at this. Ooh, I yes. can't wait. It's super girly. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry to our male audiences, but yes, anyway. You know, when we talk about the new year, usually yeah. we also talk about resolutions. Mm. New looks, new feeling, new emotions, new goals, and... And one of the things that we would like to talk about is new trends in nails, yes, right? Yes, of course, why not? <laughs> and I think um, nails or nails art now is not only uh, focusing on women. Yes. As we understand. see Harry Styles, they, they always put colorful nails really? all the time throughout ah. the years. Every time you go to concert and everything, <laughs> and it was like, oh, oh my God, not With the mic. Nail. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> that, that's why it's become more interesting. Exactly, and that's why we have uh, the owner of a nail studio here. Uh, her name is Caroline Angela, mm -hmm. who is going to share with us what is exactly the latest trend in nail art in 2023. Hello. Hi. Caroline, thank you so much for being thank here. Thank you for having me. So what have we got here? What is the current trend? What is the trend of 2023? Yeah. Well, basically for the trend of 2020. 2023, mm -hmm. it might be like the aura like this. Mm -hmm. It's like airbrush nails. Mm -hmm. So it blended perfectly as well like the chrome since Hailey Bieber used it. Yeah. Hailey Bieber used it named Donut Glass Nails. Uh -huh. It's got viral since then. Oh, wow. Okay. As well the cat eye. Mm -hmm. This one, oh, the cat eye. Nowadays people call it like velvet nails. Yeah. Velvet so nails. we using magnet. Uh -huh. to make the dimension. This is the magnet that yes. you're talking about. Oh, These little we sticks are here. We going to use it Jacket. later. Oh, nice. <laughs> and what about this one, metallic chrome? Yeah, this one also like the silver lining, gold mm -hmm. lining will be a trend in this year, I guess. Nice, wow. I love this one. It's so glam. Which mm. one do you like? This one. Oh, the top. Yeah, the yes. one. <laughs> I love this color. It would look really good yeah. on, with your skin tone, Ooh, especially. Very and speaking good. of skin tone, right? Yeah. We do have to uh, pay attention to uh, our skin tone when, mm -hmm. it it, when it comes to choosing colors. Mm -hmm. So how do we do that? Exactly. For me, like, uh, generally in Indonesia, there is two types of skin tone, right? Mm -hmm. Like the thin one and the brighter one. Mm -hmm. For the thin one, I guess better to use bright color, oh, like okay. red mm -hmm. or like electric blue because it makes statement to your looks. Mm. Yes. But for like the brighter color, mm. I guess it's better to use like navy blue, oh, gray, okay. like tone color. Okay. So it doesn't look pale. Yeah. Mm. Ah, okay. But, uh, so if we're talking about nail and trans part of fashion industry, is there any differences bef uh, between the two, uh, the, the years? This year and last year or previous year? Is there a very significant difference? Well, to be honest, mm -hmm. there is no huge difference between mm -hmm. that, but actually this year will be a little tweak. Mm -hmm. I mean like, uh, usually like uh, French nails, usually okay. like nude and white stripes on, oh, on top, right? Yes, yeah, that's you know? correct. But I right, like that. Like this year, I think there is a tweak with vibrant color, like fluorescent color, oh. so nude and shocking pink. Oh, something really? Like that. yeah, that's so nice. It's tweak, but, and the shape maybe, Instead of just like the curve, yeah, yeah. maybe like irregular shape. Oh, so it will be cute. cute. Yeah. I cannot wait. And also, <laughs> you know, back then when we were talking about our parents' generation, <laughs> right? There was only one kind of nail polish, it is. which is the regular nail polish. And then the industry evolved. Mm. Suddenly, we have gel nail polish. Mm -hmm. And then, we, what else? What else do we have? Halal gel polish. Halal right gel polish. Yeah. Breathable. Yeah. Breathable, breathable, breathable gel polish. Gel polish. Ah. So basically, the breathable gel polish is like halal certification mm -hmm. using like halal ingredients mm -hmm. and it's water based. So it's aman for Muslim people yeah. to yeah. use and it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's very safe now. Oh, I see. But yeah. in terms of um, it's, what do you call that? Um, Tahanan. Oh, durability. Yeah. Durability. durability. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Hello, my English. In terms of durability, mm. uh, especially with the uh, with the halal ones, mm -hmm. because since it's breathable, water I assume water-based. Mm -hmm. I assume that it's actually also better for the health of our, our our nails, right? It is. But in terms of durability, how long does it last usually? For the halal gel polish, uh, the durability will be sh shorter. Oh, okay. It's, Approximately two weeks, okay. two, two weeks, but like the regular gel police, maybe four weeks or more. Oh, right. I see. What about the colors? Is there any different yeah. uh, with the with the regular one or a gel and the breathable? Is it a more vibrant or more uh, pop yeah. with the with the regular one when compared to the uh, breathable nail polish? 
for now, regular uh, breathable gel polish have limited colors. Oh, I see. Because okay. it's a new thing. Yeah, it's new thing. All right. But for the nail art as well, mm -hmm. we cannot do like explore so much yeah. in halal gel polish yeah. compared to regular gel polish you because the texture is right. very. Running. Um, running. Oh, it is. I see. All right. Right. I, I, I think the first time I saw this sort of um, pattern was actually uh, on one of my friends, <laughs> my good friend's uh, nails. And I was curious, like, wow, this is so beautiful. How do they do it? Mm -hmm. You are actually going to teach us how to do it. Yes. Right? Let's do this. <laughs> Let's do this. And it's not. And it's going to be super difficult. <laughs> no, no, no. It's very easy, actually. <laughs> so basically, we only use this. Yes. The Magnet hack. Okay. And what is it called again? The magnet? Yeah, we use magnet stick. Okay, oh, magnet stick. Mm -hmm. Magnet okay. stick. And this is the nails. Yeah. We will try to use this one. Mm -hmm. So you can choose like any color you want. Okay. Like the green one, blue or purple. All right. Mm -hmm. I like this blue. Nice. Maybe you should try the blue one then. Oh, we use this. Yeah, nails. and we use one this. Would you like? I want the green this one. The green one. Yeah. So, with, to, to create this nice. effect, does the base always have to be black? No, actually, you can do any colors, like nude or black or navy, but darker color will be better. Right. Oh, so, okay. it will be more appeal. Okay. Let's okay. see what's going down Let's here. See. Okay. Yeah. So, Use we have this? fake nails. I mean, we have sure. nails here. Woo! Woo! All right. <laughs> I'll help you. Oh, thank you. Okay. So we have these thank black you. nails here. And then... <laughs> going to do to create that a uh, glittery effect Ooh, nice. is to paint it yeah so we just with paint the it colors like that like uh -huh. put it all together put it all together just swipe it oh, oh my god i'm so like this I took just that. like that mm -hmm. swipe it can you see it cover can I take more amount i guess oh okay close ups close ups close ups ah there you go nah look oh, so this is what we do right but this nail shape is really beautiful. What about my nail shape? <laughs> oh, shape. you're too hard on yourself. So, <laughs> so this is what happens, right? But the effect that we're trying to create now okay. is that gradation. So I'm going to use the stick. This is magnetic stick. Woo, 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 woo. You see the difference? Huh? You see How? the difference? You see the difference How a little bit? How do that? Woo. Maybe it's not, it's not that obvious. Okay, let me do it again. Let me do it again. I so, think green will be more appeal. Ah, try Shafira's then. All right. Okay. The oh, yeah, one. the green one. The green I one. think that's a little bit more this obvious. One. Oh, it's matching with my blazer. <laughs> nice. Okay. All right. Use this one. Gone. Yes. Okay. Gone. What? 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 Oh, wow. <laughs> it works like magic. Yeah, it, and you can choose like any colors and any base. It's so cool. So what, what if we this? swipe it again, it will be. <laughs> Look at her. She's like a little girl. I know. She's like, we can play with the nails. With the new nice. <laughs> oh wow! I can do this all year. I know, right? <laughs> so this is if if we want to have this sort of style, so cool. what should we say to the nail artist? Just say it's stargazing. Uh, in our salon, we call it stargazing, but right. in general, we can say cat eye or velvet nails. Oh, cat okay. eyes or velvet nails. Mm. Okay. How long have you been doing this business, yeah. uh, Caroline? Actually, Rinka was open in 2017, right. so almost six years now. Wow. Mm. What first drew wow. you to nails, to nail art? Actually, I just to do nails for myself, yeah. mm -hmm. firstly. Oh. <laughs> then. Start in, this is interesting, and then I learn yeah. more, and then I take the certification oh, wow. as well in Japan, and then oh, nice. back to Indonesia. I go, I open. You business. open your own business. Yeah. How long did it take for you to mm. to learn how to do this? Actually, back in Japan, there yeah. is a certification from the government to become oh, a nailist. Oh, oh, really? Yeah, it's oh, quite wow. different in Indonesia. It's a government program yeah, then. Yeah, so it's like one year and then you take the license okay. and then you can work in salon. Yeah. Oh. And then after then, here it is. Is it because wow. of the demands uh, mm. in the country that is so high? Or? I think because the standard of the country, Okay. they need to, you need to be like, 
certified, yeah, certified oh, and, and legit, safe and legit, the, the, then you uh, can yeah, work the at the salon. Nice. So speaking about the uh, skills, mm. speaking about the course that you take and certification that you have, uh, is there any opportunity for someone who willing to learn mm. and to be a nail artist as well, like you, uh, to learn here? Yes, of mm. course. Uh, we also have like the courses mm -hmm. that we at conduct. your place at your studio. Yeah, at our at our places. Mm -hmm. So we have two options like the beginner one, like just for hobby, and then also the advanced one who want to open the salon okay. by their soil. Okay. Like that. And oh. really cool. Okay. How is the ch um, how is the uh, business opportunities for the nail artists and nail salon in Indonesia? In Indonesia, Indonesia yeah. especially. Right now, you see like um, nails become part of the fashion of their yes. selves. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me about it, girl. Yeah, when you go to like holiday or yeah. vacation, yeah. Um, <laughs> special occasion like wedding or party, you yes. must think, okay, we should do nails, yeah. <laughs> something like that. So I think it's a good industry like yeah. to, to work on it. Oh, <laughs> yeah, nice. what does it mean taking care of our nails? Because I, 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 I probably go to a nail salon mm. only once a year. Mm. Just like you said, whenever I have a long holiday, <laughs> I will beautify my nails. <laughs> but uh, how important is it to take care of our, our nails, like doing manicures, pedicures? I think it's good for the hygiene. Mm -hmm. The hygiene mm -hmm. things, especially the pedicure, it's good like uh, to have hygiene, clean food, so mm -hmm. it doesn't smell yes. it doesn't. Mm -hmm. uh, and it looks clean because if there is like, for example, you you have ingrown nail, mm -hmm. yes. ingrown nails, yes. it's very hurt. Yeah, yeah. Super so painful. It's super painful. So it is good to have once a month at least. Once a month. Yeah, once a month to do the nails. Mm. So you, it's okay not to put nail polish, mm -hmm. but keep it clean. Okay. Yeah. Then this is for men and women usually. Yes. Because I know that our colleague Paul, Paul. I think he does manicures and mm. pedicures Very as well. Exactly. exactly. And also, when uh, talking about nail polish, uh, the kinds of nail polish, right? We have the regular one, we have the halal one, and also we have the gel one. And the gel one is usually, is actually the most durable. Mm. But also, um, some of my friends and I are, have this concern that mm. if we do it too often, uh, with the gel one, it will actually thin our I nails. See. So how do we make sure that, yes, we beautify ourselves by having beautiful nails, but at the same time, we take care of the nails' mm. health? Mm -hmm. First, we should make sure the ingredient, actually the gel polish in this right now yeah. have various price mm -hmm. as yes. well. Yes. Like the cheapest one until the quite expensive one. Yes. We may, should make sure the ingredients is safe for nails, right. not oh, just okay. cheap one. And as well, for the removing, usually it's already grown. Mm -hmm. yes. You should go to salon to remove it. Oh. Not remove it yourself. Not peel it off yeah. by yourself. Yes. It's satisfying. It the nail, but, right? I know. <laughs> it's but, difficult to peel it. Yeah. Though, right? yeah. But it's somehow people often to peel it and then your nails become Ruin, you ruin yeah, your nails, yeah, right, but, yeah. so you should go to the salon to remove it properly okay. and then do the manicure and gi we give you the vitamin okay. for your nails. Ah, I see. So basically the treatment is better. Yeah. Uh, Once it's a month better then? to do. Um, or after treatment? Four times a, a year? Four times a year. Actually, I do nails already 10 years, yes. non-stop. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, but with a good treatment. Right. It doesn't ruin your nails. Ah, oh, nice. Mm. Okay. So, Caroline, uh, since you are now as a professional uh, nail artist, yeah. uh, is there any uh, idols in uh, nail <laughs> idols. artist industry or preferences <laughs> to create new style of nail art or collaborate with another uh, nail artist? Yeah, for sure. For collaborate with nail artists, we have been working together with a makeup artist named Marlene Harliman. Mm -hmm. So the idea is we make custom press nail, uh, nail art box. Mm -hmm. So basically the bride-to-be uh -huh. don't have time to go to the salon yeah. or maybe not have good salon in their town. Yeah. So we make it custom design with various designs. So the bride-to-be just put it and press it instantly uh -huh. pretty. So we did we did that, also with some public figure in Indonesia like 
Andin Shia, Andy, oh, okay. to match with their performance. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. that's wonderful. Mm. All right. So it's promising then. It's yeah. super promising. Right. I mean, especially in, in urban areas, I mean, big cities. Right? Yes, yeah. Especially now people are going out again. Hello. Yeah. Hello. The pandemic is almost over. We're not waving over. like this. We're... Yeah, we're... Hello. <laughs> Hello. So, Caroline, since we know that a lot of young generation right now wants to try and learn something new, yeah. um, can be the uh, can this nail artist? Um, you, can you say it? This can be a very good profession. Yes, mm -hmm. I will definitely say it is good because. Actually, nail is still growing industry, mm -hmm. so there is a lot of opportunity there. Mm -hmm. So, if you want to involve this, mm -hmm. I think it is a good opportunity. Ah, okay, well, there. thank you. Yeah. Well, uh, spoken from a true nail artist, oh, right? Of course. <laughs> and one more thing. Go Sometimes on. people uh, probably who didn't, who don't really familiar to uh, to do their nails. They might think, oh, it's so expensive. Mm. I can afford ah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How is the price range of, uh, for doing the nail art from the basic until something extravagant? Okay. <laughs> oh, this is to get yourself uh, yes, cert again, okay. yes. certified. For the basic? Uh, no, 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 no. The price, right? Yes, the price. Oh, right. 200,000? Oh, okay. 200,000 rupiah until the 1.5 million for like the complex or wedding design, oh. the extension thing. All oh, right. Oh, yes. Have you ever experienced something that very. Oh, it's crazy, hard, difficult, but uh, we're fine. fine. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> for the making nails, mm -hmm. yes, of course. Sometimes we do the nails like four or five hours to really? do like extension and then oh. like the super complex design, like oh, the bling okay. bling one. All right. It you is. Do it in someone's hands. Yeah, in for someone's five hands. hours. Yeah, for five hours. Oh my god. And it's almost like making a tattoo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, five my. hours. Yeah. Oh, wow. But after you see the result and the customer happy, you also oh. happy, right? Oh. <laughs> That's the great thing about yeah. working as a creative person, right? <laughs> as a creative professional. Is there any like goals or dreams that you want to achieve as a nail artist in here in Indonesia, Caroline? Mm, maybe the goal is like to educate more people mm -hmm. to use the gel, the, the good and the right technique of gel polish, mm -hmm. so it doesn't ruin your nails, mm -hmm. like yeah. you said before. Yeah. Oh, all okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, expect me and Shafira coming to your studio For this sure. year. Because <laughs> Why not beautify? Hey, my yes. nails are still pretty plain right now and I need <laughs> to take too. care of them, right? Uh, it looks like it looks so boring here. <laughs> Meanwhile, I keep playing with this nail. I Amazing. Know. It's really you cute. have your own uh, pro product, right? Um, actually, we have several products uh -huh. of our studio. Uh -huh. As well, we also bring the product from Japan. Oh, so okay. We use like Japanese gel polish, oh, right. which is yes. thicker and okay. better. Oh. Yeah. You can always rely on Japanese products for quality. <laughs> anyway, hey people in Japan, hello. saying hello to you. Well, thank you so much, thank Caroline you so Angela, so much. for sharing um, about... Been fun. It has been fun. I mean, I've been playing like a little girl. <laughs> Me <here>. too. <laughs> anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you, and have thank a lovely you. day. Thank you. And Caroline. we will definitely see you at your studio. See you. Are we going to go for a break? Shall yes, of course. We'll bring you more updates from around the world when we return after the break. Stay tuned right here. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this.